five, four, three, two, one. Hello, everyone. It's me, it's Mark. And if you can see me, if you can hear me, please say yes in the comment stream so that I know that we are ready to go. <laughs> one more time. If you can see me, if you can hear me, please say yes in the comment stream so that I know that we are ready to go. We are ready to start. Do I see a yes? Not yet. I don't see a yes yet. <laughs> Come on. Can you see me? Can you hear me? Is that yes? Uh, okay, yes, we can. Okay, thank you, Lolly. Hello, Sleepwalker. I think it's been a while, has it? Or you changed your, your um, avatar. So, anyways, my name is Mark. <laughs> I'm here every Tuesday and Friday. And I'm looking now here on the comment stream, and I see a lot of the usual suspects and I see some new people and thank you for joining me as I always say without you there's no reason for me to be here so because you are here I am here all right yes 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 okay and over there is today's lesson plan all right so number one it says Hello. Oh, that means I have to say hello. So here I go. Good morning. Good afternoon. Good evening, wherever you are. Thank you for being here with me. I really appreciate it. You guys are great. And um, so you know how I feel. You know that I am always happy to be here and to be here with you. All right. And um, a lot of times, your names are difficult for me to pronounce. So I see you, but many of your names I cannot pronounce. Um, Amira. Amira? Hello, Amira. Thank you for joining me. Kumari. Hello. Thank you for being here. Uh, Florian. Hello. Thank you for being here. <laughs> okay, great, great. Um, and so far. Okay, great, great, great. Okay, we, Muhammad, hello. Okay, we got to keep going because um, I know a lot of times people maybe get bored and they leave. So I don't want to bore people, okay? So I'm going to tell you right now today's plan. And um, it's a big, as always, I always plan out a lot of things. And today's no exception. We got a big schedule here. We have lots of on the plate as they say like on the plate like for example like a dinner plate right and if it's a light meal you might just have like a, a, a salad and um maybe some rice and a little bit of meat like for a light meal but if it's a heavy meal you're gonna have like potatoes you're gonna have um vegetables you're gonna have meat maybe some fish you're gonna have a dessert so let's say heavy so a lot on the plate so today's lesson is a heavy plate we have a lot on the plate for you today um we are going to do some pattern cards that i'm making right now so i want to test these out with you and we are going also we are also doing um some vocabulary practice with these index cards and then after that, we are going to do some dictation cards here. And then we will do Lolly's Revenge, a conversation between Joe and Sue, Joe and Sue. And that's four parts to that, to Lolly's Revenge. We'll do reading, or no, no, we'll do listening. So you will listen, you will, I will ask you questions, you will answer those questions. We will read it together and we will shadow the conversation. So that's a four-part activity right there. And then we will talk about gadgets today, gadgets and technology, all right? Then after that, we will do a picture speculation. I have a picture, and I will ask you questions based on that picture. And then we will, if we have time, because I always plan 
more than we can do. And if we can't get it finished today, we will do it next time. So that will be Friday. Today's Tuesday. So what we don't get done on Tuesday, we will do on Friday and um, so forth. So we have lots of things to do. And let's get going, shall we? All right. Yes, yes. Oh, oh, I forgot. We always have a toast at the beginning of our lesson. Yeah, we have to have a toast for good luck. So here I have my tumbler. It's my orange tumbler with a black lid there. And I'm going to pop it open just like that. And let's see. Let's toast to a fun productive, interesting, wonderful, informative lesson. Yes, okay, everyone, let's, let's, um, let's bump glasses here. Or if you don't have a, if you don't have a glass or, or, a, or a cup or a mug or a tumbler, let's just bump hands here. Bump fists. Bump, 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 bump to a great, Lesson, cheers, everyone. Because we had a toast, we have to have a sip, yeah. Woo, it's hot, 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 delicious coffee, hot, delicious coffee. Mmm, ah, fantastic, <laughs> fantastic. Okay, I'll put the coffee down on the table so it's not in your way. Okay, so let's do it. Number one, let's do the pattern cards here okay cheers everyone okay i have these are some new cards i'm making and they are there's two cards there's a beginning card which is the pattern and there's a finish card and um here for example our starting card our starter card is which which so we're going to do a which pattern which and for example cards that go with which for example here which bug is cuter <laughs> which bug is cuter yeah so we have which which bug is cuter goes this yeah goes this way which bug is cuter which bug is cuter <laughs> um which lunch is better? Which lunch is better? Which, which bag do you like? Which bag do you like? Which sweet is tastier? Which sweet is tastier? Okay, we'll go one more time. Which sweet is tastier? Which... <laughs> Lolly, which bag do you like? Which bag do you like? Oh, Jake, hello, Jake. Which lunch is better? Which lunch is better? Which bug is cuter? <laughs> which bug is cuter? Okay, great, great. Okay, now I want you to... May, I want you to finish these. Sorry, I got to wipe some dust off here. Okay, I want you to finish this pattern, please. So which is your sentence? Okay, so here's the pattern. Which, which. <coughs> so for example... I, I have which bug is cuter, which bug is cuter, which lunch is better, which lunch is better, which bag do you like, which bag do you like, which sweet is tastier, which sweet is tastier. So I want you to make a which sentence, please. Which class are you in? Very nice. Yeah, Mia. Which class are you in? Yeah, that's a good, that's a nice sentence. Which class are you in? Very useful. Uh, which day do you like? Which day do you like? Good, Mohammed. Which day do you like? 
Which day do you like? I like Sunday. Ah, uh, you like the gummy bear. So Jake, you like the gummy bear. This is a jelly bean and this is a gummy bear. Jake likes the gummy bear. Okay, um, Amira, su suntan, suntan. <laughs> I'll just call you suntan, okay? Which color do you like? Good, which color do you like? Which color do you like? Which color do you like? Which football team do you like? I like the Rams. American football. <laughs> which, 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 which football team did you? Yeah, which football team? American football? I like the Los Angeles Rams, American football team. Officer, you like sun Saturday and Sunday best. Um, which, f which fruit is your favorite? Which fruit is your favorite? Good. Which fruit is your favorite? Good. Which fruit is your favorite? Uh, which car do you prefer? 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 Malaysian football team. Ah, you're thinking soccer, huh, Jake? Soccer. Uh, which president do you like? Trump or Obama? Oh, no. Tr Obama, of course. Okay. Uh, HB, hello. Uh, which lunch do you like? Which lunch do you... I like, um, I like Mexican lunch. I like taco lunch. Okay, good. Apple. Okay, you prefer... Okay, um, which day do you like? I like Sunday. Uh, which color do you like? I like brown. Um, which football team do you like? I like the Rams. Which fruit do you like? Do you which fruit is your favorite? Um my favorite is oranges, I think. Oranges. Uh which car do you prefer? I prefer my car. <laughs> okay, great job. Okay, which Okay, let's do one more, shall we? Let's do one more. Okay, that's good, guys, everyone. How about, here, did, 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 did. Okay, that's the pattern, did. And then, for example, the finish card. Did I forget anything? Did I forget anything? Did I forget anything? Did they cook dinner? Did they cook dinner? Did they cook dinner? Did, did she make that? Did she make that? Did, did you enjoy the movie? Did you enjoy the movie? Okay, one more time. Did you enjoy the movie? Did, did she make that? Did she make that? Did. Did they cook dinner? Did they cook dinner? Did. Did I forget anything? Did I forget anything? Did, 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 did. Okay, so let's, let me see what you got for did, okay? Did, 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 did. Oops, we need uppercase because it's the beginning of a sentence. Did, 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 did. Okay, let's see. Did she make that? Okay, great, I want to hear. Uh, did you write your homework? Did you write your home? Or actually we say, did you do your homework? That's more natural. Did did you do your 
homework. Did you do your homework? Did you sleep well? Oh, very good. I like that. Did you sleep well? Did you sleep well? That's a, that's a very good sentence. We use that a lot. Did you go to the supermarket? Yeah, good. Did you go to the supermarket? Did you go to the supermarket? Did you eat enough? Did you eat enough? Did you eat enough? Did you eat enough? Did you go to work? Good, HB. Very good. Did you go to work? Did you go to work today? Did you rest well? Did you rest well? Did you rest well? Did you rest well? Uh, did you see my hat? Very good, Mia. Did you see my hat? Did you see my hat? Did you see my hat? Did you miss me? Oh, did you eat the pizza? Or did you like... How about, did you like the pizza? Did you like, the, because, for example, you made it, and then, oh, did, after you finished it, oh, did you like it? Did you like the pizza? Did you like the pizza? Prefer means, Jake, prefer is like um, preference. So which one do you like? Which one do you prefer? So that means, which one do you like? So preference. Which one um, do you like more? Which one is, which one do you like best? Which one do you like more? Okay. Did you practice English? <laughs> of course. Did you practice English? Very good. I like that sentence. Did you practice English? Okay, good. I think we got we we got a lot here. Okay, so let's go over this again. Did you do your homework? Yes, I did. Did you sleep well? Uh, I slept okay. I slept okay. Um, did you go to the supermarket? Oh no, I forgot. No, I didn't. Oh no, I forgot. Um, did you eat enough? Oh, I ate too much. <laughs> I ate too much. Um, did you go to work? Yes, of course. Why? Yes, of course. Why? Why do you ask? Um, did you rest well? Yes, thank you. Yes, I had a nice rest. I had a nice rest. Um, did you see my hat? No, I didn't. Sorry. No, no, I didn't. Um, do you like pizza? Yes, it's my favorite. Yes, it's my favorite. Did you practice English? Of course, I practice every day. Yes, I did. I practice every day. <laughs> okay, everyone, nice job. Well done. And right here, I have my phone. I have my phone because I'm going to take a picture of the whiteboard. And I always take a picture of the whiteboard. And then I post it on my Facebook group page, Mark Kulik English Speaking Practice, so that you can check it out anytime you want. You could always go back and look at the whiteboards for more practice, okay? So I'm going to enter my passcode here, open my apps, press the phone or press the camera app right there, and I'm going to step behind the camera to take a picture of the whiteboard, okay? So you won't see me, but you can hear me because I'm behind the camera and I'm going to take a picture of the whiteboard. Here we go. 
four, three, two, one. Okay. I have a picture. I took the picture of the whiteboard. And after today's lesson, I will post it on my Facebook group page, Mark Kulik English Speaking Practice. Okay. So that is done. We did the experimental pattern cards. These are pattern cards. So today's patterns were which and did, which and did. Okay, and then next, on Friday, we'll do some more, okay? So these are kind of nice warm-up activities to get going, to start, um, get, I want you to start thinking in English, so this is a good way to warm up, to get you to think in English. Uh, where are you, Mark? I am in Japan. I'm in Japan. I live, uh, I live in Japan. I'm from California, Los Angeles, California, but I moved to Japan about 23 years ago. In 1996, I came to Japan. Um, Mohammed, do you mean your friend? Airport? Okay, I'm not sure. Okay. Cheers. Okay. Okay, I'm looking over there, and... Next is our index cards, our vocabulary index cards, okay? So I'm going to erase this, but I took a picture, so that's not a problem because we got a picture, and after the lesson, I will upload it to my Facebook group page, Mark Kulik English Speaking Practice. Okay, here we go. Right here, I have two index cards. And there are, there's a topic with vocabulary that corresponds to that topic. So we have two topics. And here, topic number one is, oh, sorry, I got to, oh, I almost had a big sneeze. Okay. Topic is, foods that are white. Foods that are white foods that are white okay foods that are white so i need you to write foods that are white okay up oh, milk that was fast okay good arash milk Milk is white. Okay, milk. Foods that are white. Rice. Good, good. Rice. I saw yogurt there. Yogurt is white for sure. Potatoes. Yeah, good, Lolly. Yep, potatoes are white inside, right? Potatoes are white. Very good. Cheese, yeah, cheese is white. We have white cheese for sure. Cream is white. You guys are doing good. I saw flour. Flour for sure is white. Ice cream, vanilla ice cream, vanilla ice cream. Vanilla ice cream is white. Yes, it is. Egg whites, eggs, eggs, we have yellow and white, so the egg whites, we say egg whites, egg whites, where the yellow, we say that's the yolk, the yolk, the white part is, we say egg whites, and the yellow part is um, yolk. White chocolate, oh, I don't like white chocolate. No, thank you. White chocolate, I do not like. White chocolate is not chocolate. <laughs> white chocolate is strange. I don't know what white chocolate is, but I don't like it. Oh, sugar. Sugar is white. Yes, it is. Butter, I don't, butter is white. Tofu, tofu. Mushrooms, I saw mushrooms. I think that was lolly, mushrooms. 
Yes. Okay, good. Onions. Lolly like Lolly likes onion pie. She likes onions. Onions are white. We have white onions. Yes. Marshmallows. Marshmallows are white. Marshmallows. Yes. Marshmallows. Okay, marshmallows. Yes, good, good, good. Salt, garlic. God, you guys, I f didn't even think about that. Yeah, okay. Okay, that's good. We're full here. We're full. Okay, that is great. Um, tofu is whiter than butter. That is true. <laughs> butter. Maybe there, maybe, because a lot of times, the people who make the food, they add color. So maybe um, natural butter is white. But like I go to the supermarket, it's always yellow. That might be because they put food coloring in there. Maybe they change it. So maybe I've never seen um, natural butter. Like make you make it yourself butter. So I'm going to put butter there. I'm not sure. But I'll put butter there. Okay. And here are the, this is what I did right here. Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, chicken meat. That's right, Mohammed. Chicken. Chicken meat is white. That's right. Um, foods are white. Vanilla pudding. I like vanilla pudding. Vanilla ice cream. Cream cheese. Whipped cream. Cottage cheese. Cottage cheese. Cottage cheese. Bread, the white bread, milk, cream, angel food cake. I like angel food cake. And mashed potatoes, mashed potatoes. Yes, yes. Fish, that's right. Fish and chicken is white. Okay, I got to put fish and chicken. Fish, chicken. Okay, good, good, good. All right, so that's good. Okay, let's do another one more topic. Okay, our next topic is things that need batteries. 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 Mobile phone, yes. Mobile phone needs batteries. That's... Laptops need batteries, yep, laptops for sure, good. Laptops, TV, remote, yeah, yeah, remote controllers need. Remote controllers. Okay, remote controllers need batteries, clocks, clocks. Okay, games, how about electric game, electronic games? Electronic games. Yes, electronic games need batteries. Um, cars need batteries, yes, cars need batteries. Very good, cars need batteries. Um, oh, torch, we say flashlight. We say flashlight in... American English, we say flashlight, not torch. Flashlights, yes. Flashlights need batteries. Toys need batteries. Good, Mia. Toys need batteries. Toys. Very good. Um, airplanes. <laughs> I'm sure they do. I, yeah, airplanes, yeah. Okay, airplanes need batteries. Uh Tablet, yeah, tablet computers, yeah, tablet. Um, fans need batteries, yeah, the little, 
those little um, hand fans there, the little electric fans, yeah. Fans need batteries. Motorcycles, scooters, yeah. <laughs> uh, motorcycles, scooters. Okay, good, good. All right, computers need batteries, yeah. Computers. Yes, yes, yes. Forklift, okay. <laughs> okay, okay, that's good. Okay, here's what I have. Here's what hair dryers, electronic tin openers. Good, good. Okay, this is what I have. Cars, flashlights, toys, remote controls, radios, watches, calculators, clocks, MP3 players, Game Boy. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Mic, right? I have, I need a battery here, right there. I need batteries, yep. Hair clippers, yeah. <laughs> hair clippers need batteries. I have batteries for my hair clippers, yes. <laughs> okay, that was very good. All right, here we do another little activity. We keep going, okay? And I'm going to take a picture, yeah? So I'll take a picture of the whiteboard, and you can check it out on my Facebook group page, Mark Kulik English Speaking Practice, okay? I am going to step around the camera where you can't see me, but you can hear me. Here we go. I'm walking around behind the camera. You can't see me because I'm taking a picture of the whiteboard. I'm going to do a little countdown here. Four, three, two, one. Okay, I got the picture. And... I will upload this later today, okay? <laughs> uh, Sabina, hello. Good to see you. Thank you for coming. Yay, Sabine. 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 Good, good to see you. Okay, let's do our next activity, which is dictation cards. Dictation cards. I got the dictation cards right here. Yes, yes, yes. Ah, okay. Right here. So we are going to do dictation practice. So that means I'm going to read a sentence from the card. You will write down what I say word for word. So if you have a pencil, if you have paper, that would be fantastic because then you get lots of practice. You listen to me and you write down what I say then, after you write on your paper, then write it in the computer. So you're getting double practice, double practice, right? Practice, practice one on paper, practice two in your computer, okay? So let's do it, yeah? And I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight cards. Oh, and we did the... This is the second set where um, last Friday we did the first eight and today we will finish the, the last eight, okay? And so this is Y cards. Why, 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 okay? So we have eight cards. That's fantastic. Okay, great. So are we ready to go? Mia says ready to go. Lolly says she has a pencil and paper. She's ready to go with the eight cards, yes. Okay, Sabine, are you ready? Okay. Okay, Arash is ready. Very good. Okay, let's do it. Card number one. Card number one. Card number one. Okay, good. We're ready. Very, very nice. Okay, here we go. Let's count down to dic dictation time. Okay, here we go. Okay, good. Amira, Amira, Santan, Santan, here we go. Fa wait, five, four, three, two, one. Card number one. Why were you late? Why were you late? Why were you late? Card number one. Why were you late? Why were you late? 
card number one. Why were you late? Why were you late? Very nice, very good. Why were you late? Why were you late? Why were you late? Why were you late, Mohammed? Very good. Okay, Lolly, good. Why were you late? Max Power, why were you late? Mohammed, why were you late? Uh, uh, Santan, why were you late? Uh, Tomas, why were you late? Okay. Gigi, hello, why were you late? Rita, hello, Rita, why were you late? Okay, Lolly's never late, is she? No. Why were you late? Why were you late? Okay, Jake, all right, well done. Okay, here we go. Card number two, card number two. Count down. Five, four, three, two, one. Card number two. Sorry, I had to vacuum the house. 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 Okay, Mia. Sorry, I had to vacuum the house. Yes. Sleepwalker. Sorry, I had to vacuum the house. Yes. Muhammad. Sorry, I had to vacuum the house. Yes. Suntan. Sorry, I had to vacuum the house. Lolly. Sorry, I had to vacuum the house. Uh, Arash. Sorry, I had to vacuum the house. Riza. Sorry, I had to vacuum the house. Okay. Sorry, I had to vacuum the house. Very good. Sorry, I had to vacuum the house. Shelly. Sorry, I had to vacuum the house. Tomas. Sorry, I had to vacuum the house. Okay, very good. Young. Sorry, I had to vacuum the house. Sorry, I had to vacuum the house. Okay, very good. That was number two. Okay, Tomas, vacuum. <laughs> vacuum. Jake, sorry, I had to vacuum the house. I had to. Okay, okay, HB, sorry, I had to vacuum the house. Very good, HB. Okay, card number three. Card number three. Count down. Five, four, three, two, one. One. Sorry, I had to make coffee. <laughs> Rita, Rita. Hello, Rita. Very well. Okay, number three. Why didn't you call? Why didn't you call? Why didn't... Diana. Sorry, I had to vacuum the house. No problem, young. Why didn't you call, Mia? Why didn't you call, number three? Why didn't you call, sleepwalker? Eleonora, hello, because I had to vacuum the house. Okay, Suntan, why didn't you call? Max Power, why didn't you call? Gigi, Lolly, why didn't you call? Rita, why didn't you call? Mabasa, why didn't you call? Young, why didn't you call? Eleonora, why didn't you call? Uh, Arif, why didn't you call? Mogador, why didn't you call? Prani, why didn't you call? Call. Okay, very good. Altoon, hello. Why? didn't you call? Why didn't you call? Okay, number four, card number four, countdown. Five, four, three, two, one. I had a meeting. I had a meeting. Jake, why didn't you call? Because I was too busy. 
Because I was too busy. Why didn't you call? I had a meeting. I had a meeting. I had a meeting. Card number four. I had a meeting. Arash. I had a meeting. Sleepwalker. I had a meeting. Uh, Reyes. I had a meeting. Muhammad. I had a meeting. Max. I had a meeting. Arthur. I had a meeting. Oh, you're moving too fast. <laughs> <laughs> I had a meeting. It's moving. You guys are like cranking. You're cranking, cranking. Okay, very good. Lucky. Lucky's in the house. I had a meeting. I see Lucky. Why didn't you call? Why were you late, Lucky? Why were you late? <laughs> okay. I had a meeting. Okay, card number five. Card number five. Count down. Five, four, three, two, one. Card number five. I waited for two hours. I waited for two hours. I waited for two hours. I see luck. I waited for two hours. I waited for two hours. Sleepwalker, I waited for two hours. Uh, Reyes, I waited for two hours. Lisa, I waited for two hours. Lucky, I took a bath. It is very hot. It's very hot in Japan, too, here. It's super hot here in Japan, lucky. Okay, I waited for two hours. 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 Everyone's doing great. All right, Tomas. Okay, come all. I waited for two hours. HB, I waited for two hours. T W O H B. T W O two one two one hour two hours. I waited for two hours. Mabasa, I waited for two hours. Good. Sawranada, <laughs> that's a long name. I can't pronounce your name. Sawananda, Sawananda. I waited for two hours. Okay. Number six. Here we go. Card number six. Count down. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, good, Jake. Yes. Okay, card number six. Sorry, I was sleeping. Sorry, I was sleeping. Sorry, I was sleeping. I waited for two hours. Sorry, I was sleeping. Sorry, I was sleeping. Sorry, I was sleeping. Oh, Anna Roach de Silva. Hello. Sorry, I was sleeping. Very good. Sorry, I was sleeping. Sorry, I was sleeping. Rita, sorry, I was sleeping. Lolly, sorry, I was sleeping. Gigi, sorry, I was sleeping. Lucky. Sorry, I was sleeping. Tomas, sorry, I was sleeping. Mohammed, sorry, I was sleeping. Mogador, sorry, I was sleeping. Santan, sorry, I was sleeping. Anna, sorry, I was sleeping. HB, sorry, I was sleeping. Very good. And HB, you put number six. You're keeping it in order. That's great, HB. Very good. Thank you for doing that. Sorry, I was sleeping. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, card number seven. Number seven. Count down. Five, four, three, two, one. Card number seven. Why didn't you do your homework? Why didn't you do your homework? Why didn't you do your homework? Diana. Sorry, I was sleeping. 
Jake, sorry, I was sleeping. Young, sorry, I was sleeping. Okay, Mia, why didn't you do your homework, sleepwalker? Number seven, thank you for, yes, Mia, good. You put seven, two there, very good. Why didn't you do your homework, Arash? Why didn't you do your homework, Muhammad? Why didn't you do your homework, Gigi? Lolly, why didn't you do your homework, Shelly? Why didn't you do your homework, Rita? Why didn't you do your homework, Leza? Why didn't you do your homework? Very good. Young, why didn't you do your homework, Suntan? Why didn't you do your homework? Prani, why didn't you do your homework? Lucky, why didn't you do your homework? Tomas, why didn't you do your homework? Anna, why didn't you do your homework? Why didn't you do your homework? Because I'm a lazy student. <laughs> because I'm a lazy student. Okay, number, <laughs> sorry, I was sleeping. <laughs> why didn't you do your homework? Sorry, I was sleeping. Okay. Good, good, good. Why didn't you do your homework? Okay, card number eight. Here we go. Count down. Card number eight. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, office or uh, Jake. Good. I was in a car accident. I was in a car accident. Lolly, I always do. I know. Of course, Lolly, you're a fantastic student. I know you always do your homework, Lolly. I know. I know that. I was in a car accident. Me, I was in a car accident. I was in a car accident. Number eight. I was in a car accident. I was in a car accident. Max, I was in a car accident. Why didn't you do your homework? I was in a car accident. Oh no, Lolly, sorry, I was in a car accident. Rita, I was in a car accident. Oh no. Very good, everyone. I was in a car accident. Ouch. I was in a car. Good, HB, I was in a car accident. Very good. Anna, I was in a car accident. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. Very good, everyone. Now we're going to shadow, right? So um, like a shadow, right? Shadow moves wherever you move, right? You can see the shadow behind me on my whiteboard. My arm moves up. The shadow moves up. My arm moves down. My shadow moves down. My shadow is moving at the same time as I am. So you will be my shadow. That is you will not repeat after me. You will speak at the same time as I do. You will move at the same time as I do. You will speak at the same time as I do, all right? So let's shadow these cards, all right? Here we go. Me too. I'm afraid of car accidents. I've never been in a car accident, never. Okay, here we go. Card number one, shadow. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Why were you late? Why were you late? Now you're speaking the same time as I am, right? Why were you late? 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 Sorry, I had to vacuum the house. 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 Why didn't you call? 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 I had a meeting. 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 I waited for two hours. 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 
I waited for two hours. Sorry, I was sleeping. 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 Why didn't you do your homework? 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 I was in a car accident. 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 Okay, very good. Yay, dictation card. Yeah, you did it. Very good. That was eight cards. Fantastic. Good job, everyone. All right. Okay, I'm going to put the cards down. And now it's time for Lolly's Revenge. We're moving right along, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. We are moving. No bored people, please. Okay, I took a picture of the whiteboard a while ago, so I'm going to erase it because we're going to do Lolly's Revenge. Yay, Lolly's Revenge. Lolly's Revenge is a conversation between two people, Joe and Sue. We are going to practice a conversation between Joe and Sue. We will do four steps. Step one, I will read the conversation. That means you will listen to the conversation carefully because step two, I'm going to ask you questions about the conversation. Step three, we will read the conversation together. And then step four, we will shadow the conversation like we just did with the um, dictation cards. We'll do it with the conversation. All right. Sounds good. Yes. Okay, good. Right here, I have a conversation between Joe and Sue. Joe and Sue. So everyone, please say hello to Joe. This is Joe. Hello, everyone. This is Sue. Hello, everyone. My name is Sue. <laughs> okay, here we go. Are we ready for... The conversation between Joe and Sue, yes? Okay, let's do a countdown, <laughs> yes. O-M-T-Q-T, -T, that's right. Okay, let's do that. Let's go ahead and put that now on the board. O-M-T, O-M-T and Q-T, yeah, okay. So we know what that means, right? O-M-T, one more time. QT, question time, right? So step one is reading, or, or actually listening for you. I'm reading and you're listening, yeah? Okay, so here we go. <laughs> yeah, Eleanor likes Eleanor's game. <laughs> OMT, QT. Okay, here we go. Here's Joe. Joe is, no, no, today Sue is first. Here's Sue. Sue is first. Everyone say hello to Sue. Okay. Sue is first. Hey, Joe, can you pick up all your gadgets? What do you mean? Your electronics are all over the place. Your laptop is on the sofa. Your drone is on the bed. Your electronic game is on the kitchen counter. Your phone is on the chair. Okay, don't break them. I'll put them away. You have too many contraptions. No wonder you can't save money. These devices are very important. What do you mean? Knowing how to use, the, knowing how to use these machines will make our life better. Really? They just seem like gimmicks. No way. It's the future. 
it's the future. Good. All right, Leza. Leza. One more time. Let's do it one more time. Let's do it one more time. What do you mean? <laughs> OMT, OMT. Okay, Sue is first. Hey, Joe, can you pick up all your gadgets? What do you mean? Your electronics are all over the place. Your laptop is on the sofa. Your drone is on the bed. Your electronic game is on the kitchen counter. Your phone is on the chair. Okay, don't break them. I'll put them away. You have too many contraptions. No wonder you can't save money. These devices are very important. What do you mean? Knowing how to use these machines will make our life better. Really? They just seem like gimmicks. No way. It's the future. It's the future. Leza. Suntan, one more time. What do you mean? No way. <laughs> Good listening, Leza. Okay. Hmm. Oh, okay. Mohammed. Okay, get to the doctors. I'll see you on Friday. Okay, thanks for coming by. Okay, Lolly, one more time and slower. Okay, I'll go slower. Here we go. Lolly is first. Here we go. Hey, Joe, can you pick up all your gadgets? What do you mean? Your electronics are all over the place. Your laptop is on the sofa. Your drone is on the bed. Your electronic game is on the kitchen counter. Your phone is on the chair. Okay, don't break them. I'll put them away. You have too many contraptions. No wonder you can't save money. These devices are very important. What do you mean? Knowing how to use these machines will make our life better. Really? They just seem like gimmicks. No way. It's the future. Yeah, take care, Mohammed. Good luck at the doctors. Good luck at the doctors. Which which one? OMT or QT? OMT QT. OMT QT. OMT QT. Which one? Which one? Which one? Are we ready for QT? Are we ready? Yes, no. Are you ready? <laughs> Lolly, you agree with Joe. <laughs> okay, so Lolly, you're ready for the contraptions. You have too many contraptions. You guys are ready. Okay, you guys are ready for QT, right? Okay, ready? Yes, yes, QT, good. Okay, Lolly, one more time. Okay, we'll do it one more time. This will be our last time, okay? Okay, here we go. OMT, here we go. Last one, last one. Okay, Jake, here we go. OMT. 
Okay, Pran. Okay, we're this uh, one more time, everybody. Here we go. Here's Sue. Sue is first. Hey, Joe, can you pick up all your gadgets? What do you mean? Your electronics are all over the place. Your laptop. Your laptop is on the sofa. Your drone is on the bed. Your electronic game is on the kitchen counter. Your phone is on the chair. Okay, don't break them. I'll put them away. You have too many contraptions. No wonder you can't save money. I see you, Eleonora. These devices are very important. What do you mean? Knowing how to use these machines will make our life better. Really? They just seem like gimmicks. No way. It's the future. It's the future. <laughs> Okay. QT. Here we go. Here we, oh, what do you mean? One more time. Question time. So we are question time. This is question time. Okay, here we go. Countdown to question time. Five, four, three, two, one. Question number one. What does Joe, no, 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 no. Question number one. What does Sue want Joe to do? What does Sue want Joe to do? What, question one. What does Sue want Joe to do? What does Sue want Joe to do? Yes, Sleepwalker, that's right. Pick up his gadgets. What does Sue want Joe to do? What does Sue want Joe to do? What does Sue want Joe to do? Tomas says, pick up all his gadgets. Yes, number one, Muhammad, pick up his gadgets, pick up his gadgets, good, pick up his gadgets, pick up all his gadgets, yes, Lolly, very good, that is the correct answer, yes, pick up his gadgets, okay, question number two, number two, where is the laptop, where is the laptop, question two, where is the laptop? Good, good young. Good prani, very good. That's right, Reyes. Okay, let's see. Question two, where is the laptop? And let's see, HB, uh, yes, HB. Sleep Park says on the sofa, yes. On the sofa, yes, Lolly, good, good. Prani, it's on the sofa. Yes, Tomas, it's on the sofa. Shelly, yeah, it's on the sofa. Okay, very good. Rita, on the sofa. Very good, Rita. Okay, yes. HB, very good. The laptop is on the sofa. On the sofa. Okay, question three. Three, where is the drone? Where is the drone? Where is the drone? Question number three. Where is the drone? Where is the drone? Question number three. Where is the drone? Ha <laughs> ha, lucky. Very good, yes. Rita, 
Lolly, yes, Lolly, good. It's on the bed. It's on the bed. Where is the drone? It's on the bed. Good, on the bed. Yes, yes, on the bed. Good, Mogador, very good. Okay, question number four. That's right, HB, Young, on the bed. It's on the bed. Okay, uh, question number four. Where is the electronic game? 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 Okay, more specific, specific sleepwalker. It's in the kitchen, but Rita. On the kitchen counter. Lolly, on the kitchen counter. The green people did it. Very, you guys are great, great, great. It's on the kitchen counter. Yes. Kitchen counter. Where, so, um, Lucky, where in the kitchen? On the kitchen counter. Where in the kitchen? On the kitchen counter. Where is the electronic game? It's on the kitchen counter. Very good. Kitchen counter, the counter, like the, the top. The kitchen counter, that's where you like you you um, chop your food up. That's the where you put things, right? So your coffee maker is on the kitchen counter. Your knife set is on the kitchen counter. Your toaster is on the kitchen counter. So Joe's electronic game is on the kitchen counter. Oh, no, 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 Sue, she doesn't want, Sue doesn't want Joe's electronic game on the kitchen counter. No, that's a no-no. Okay, question five. Where is the phone? Where is Joe's phone? Where is Joan's phone? Yes, lucky, kitchen counter. Where is Joe's phone? Question five. Yes, HB, good. Yes, Rita. Where is Joe's phone? <laughs> Where is Joe? Yes, the green girls did it again. Rita and Lolly on the chair. Very good. Yes, my green girls. <laughs> on the chair. Where's the phone? Where's Joe's phone? It's on the chair. Don't put your phone on the chair because you could sit on it and break the phone. Don't sit on the phone on the chair. <laughs> that sounds like Dr. Seuss. Don't sit on the phone on the chair next to the sofa. <laughs> <laughs> okay, good, good. Okay, number six, question number six. Why can't Joe save money? Why can't Joe save money? Why can't Joe save money? That's right, Mom, it, the phone is on the chair. Good, good. In um, why can't Joe save money? Number six. Why can't? Oh, sleepwalker. He have too many. So okay. So why can't Joe save? Because. He, he spends too much on gadgets. So he spends too much money on gadgets. He spends too much money on gadgets. So, or he has too many gadgets, contraptions. He has too many contraptions. Yes, Lolly, contraptions. Yes. So Max, he bought many electronic devices, yes. 
he has too many, so he buys too many contraptions. He buys too many gadgets. So he buys too many gadgets. Yeah, so he paid a lot, he pays a lot for his gadgets. He has too many ga- contraptions, good. He has too many contraptions, very good, contraptions. He buys too many contraptions. He buys too many devices. He buys too many gadgets. Good, good. Okay, number seven. Question number seven. Yes, Tomas, very good. Yes, Jan. Okay, number seven. Why are these devices important to Joe? Seven, why are these devices important to Joe? 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 Why are these devices important to Job? Why are these devices important to Job? That's right, Leza. Okay, Sleepwalker, to know how to use these machines are very important. Okay, yeah. Oh, lucky, they will make his life better. Knowing how to use them will make life better. Perfect. Because knowing how to use these devices will make their life better. Yes, Mia. He thinks they make his life better. Max, great. He has electronic gadgets. He likes, yeah, he likes, and that's right, Tomas, he likes electronic gadgets, and he thinks they will make his life better. (coughs) Yes, because he thinks that's the future. That's right, that's the future, he thinks that's the future. Because he buys, okay, HB, because he, because these gadgets, these devices will make his life better, HB, because these gadgets make his life better. Because these gadgets make his life better. Because these gadgets make his life better because these gadgets make his life better okay one more last one number eight here we go number eight what does sue think of these gadgets what does sue think of these gadgets what does sue Think of these gadgets. That's right, Sleepwalker. What does Sue think of these gadgets? Number eight. What does Sue? Yes, Lolly. Yes, they just seem like gimmicks. They are gimmicks. Yes, Sleepwalker. So they just seem like gimmicks yes gimmick they just seem like gimmicks very good you guys super very good gimmicks yeah so not important like a gimmick is not important it's just um a new thing a gimmick is a new thing she thinks they are contraptions and gimmicks yeah so just new things not important just a new thing, that's all, not important, just a new thing. Because 
his gadgets make his life better. Yes, that's right. That's right. HB, very good. I don't remember that. So gimmick, right? So gimmick is just a new thing, not important. Just a new thing. Okay, great, everyone. So Lolly loves gimmicks. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, great, great. Okay, let's do, let's, um, okay, that's great. So we did step one. Um, I, read the, I read the conversation. Step two, we did questions. Now, step three, let's read it together, okay? Let's, I'm going to move the laptop, my gimmick, <laughs> or my contraption here, my, this contraption. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let's let's read the conversation together, okay? Here we go. Sue is first. Hey, Joe, can you pick up all your gadgets? What do you mean? Your electronics are all over the place. Your laptop is on the sofa. Your drone is on the bed. Your electronic game is on the kitchen counter. Your phone is on the chair. Okay, don't break them. I'll put them away. You have too many contraptions. No wonder you can't save money. These devices are very important. What do you mean? Knowing how to use these machines will make our life better. Really? They just seem like gimmicks. No way, it's the future. <laughs> okay, let's do it one more time. Okay, here we go. Hey, Joe, can you pick up all your gadgets? What do you mean? Your electronics are all over the place. Your laptop is on the sofa. Your drone is on the bed. Your electronic game is on the kitchen counter. Your phone is on the chair. Okay, don't break them. I'll put them away. You have too many contraptions. No wonder you can't save money. These devices are very important. What do you mean? Knowing how to use these machines will make our life better. Really? They just seem like gimmicks. No way. It's the future. It's the future. <laughs> okay, good, good. Okay. Now, we did the reading, so that was step three. Step four is shadowing time, all right? Just like what we did with the dictation cards. Let's shadow. So I want you to speak at the same time as I do. We are going to shadow the conversation, all right? Are you ready? Yes? Okay. Count down to shadowing. So you're going to be speaking at the same time as I do, right? So we're going to speak together, same time. Five, four, three, two, one. Hey, Joe, can you pick up your gadgets? 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 What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? Your electronics are all over the place. Your electronics are all over the place. Your electronics are all over the place. Your laptop is on the sofa. Your laptop is on the sofa. Your laptop is on the sofa. Your drone is on the bed. Your drone is on the bed. Your drone is on the bed. Your electronic game is on the kitchen counter. Your electronic game is on the kitchen counter. Your electronic game is on the kitchen counter. Your phone is on the chair. Your phone is on the chair. Your phone is on the chair. Okay, don't break them. Okay, don't break them. Okay, don't break them. I'll put them away. I'll put them away. I'll put them away. I'll put them away. You have too many contraptions. You have too many contraptions. You have too many contraptions. No wonder you can't save money. No wonder you can't save money. 
No wonder you can't save money. These devices are very important. These devices are very important. These devices are very important. What do you mean? What do you mean? What do you mean? Knowing how to use these machines will make our life better. Knowing how to use these machines will make our life better. Knowing how to use these machines will make our life better. Really? They just seem like gimmicks. 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 No way! It's the future! No way! It's the future! No way! It's the future! It's the future! <laughs> okay, good, good. She thinks these gadgets are only toys. That's right, Tomas. The, she thinks they're toys. Joe thinks they're machines. <laughs> Joe thinks they're... Sue thinks they are toys, and Joe thinks they are machines. Okay, here we go. One more. Let's look at it before we put it away. Okay, here we go. Hey, Joe, can you pick up all your gadgets? What do you mean? Your, your electronics are all over the place. Your laptop is on the sofa. Your drone is on the bed. Your electronic game is on the kitchen counter. Your phone is on the chair. Okay, don't break them. I'll put them away. You have too many contraptions. No wonder you can't save money. These devices are very important. What do you mean? Knowing how to use these machines will make our life better. Really? They just seem like gimmicks. No way, it's the future, the future, okay, the future, let's look to the future, I can see the future, <laughs> okay. okay, yeah, Lolly's Revenge, woo, 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 okay, now, Lolly's Revenge, the, the conversation between Joe and Sue, are usually most of the time a a lead into the topic yeah so it's a bridge to the topic so lolly's um revenge is a bridge it's a it's a path to the topic and today's topic is gadgets and technology gadgets and technology so we will talk about these for a little bit. And um, of course, we won't get it all finished today. We will continue on Friday. But let's start today with gadgets and technology. Gadgets and technology. Gadgets and technology. Okay, gadgets and technology. So I checked out, I, I went to the dictionary to look up um, what the dictionary said what gadget is. And a gadget is a small mechanical or electro electric device or tool, especially an ingenious or novel one, okay? So this is kind of like, so some people look at gadgets as good, and some people look at gadgets as bad, or not bad, but let's see, um, like practical or obsolete. So obsolete is like not useful, okay? we don't need it right so obsolete obsolete is means um we don't need it okay so one more i'm going to read it to you one more time a gadget is a small mechanical or electric device or tool 
especially an ingenious, genius, ingenious or novel one. So novel is like a gimmick, right? So, oh, it's just something new, not, not practical, just obsolete, novel. Oh, it's a new thing. Oh, it's novel. It's, it, 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 it's, it's, it's cool today, but then um, soon people are going to forget about it. So I'll re I'm, I'm going to write down the definition here. So it says um, a gadget is a small mechanical or electric device or tool, especially, especially an ingenious, so very, very right, ingenious, like um, ingenious, like a Oh, that's that's genius. That is like, that is great, <laughs> genius. Like very, very um, brain. Like used your brain. That someone used their brain. That was um, a, like Einstein or something. Ingenious or novel. Okay, novel one. Okay, so. Gadget, a gadget is a small mechanical or electric device or tool, especially an ingenious or novel one. So here, this is, we're seeing two, two, two ways of looking at it, right? So we can look at it as ingenious, like clever, super clever, ingenious or novel. Right, like a gimmick, um, something like uh, maybe you see on TV, like a uh, an info commercial, a TV commercial, like oh, this this is a new like oh, I saw um, they had like this pen for cars. So so if you have a scratch in your car and this pen just covers the scratch perfectly, and oh. This is a great gadget to this is a great gadget to fix the scratches in your car. But it if it doesn't if it works it's whoa, that's ingenious. Wow, I can just use this pen to fix the scratches in my car. That's ingenious. Or it's just it it just doesn't work. It it's uh it's um it's um, what's the word? It, it's bogus. Like, it doesn't work. It's bogus. It's just false. Okay. A gadget is a small or electric device or tool, especially an ingenious or novel one. That's right. Okay. Here we go. So, um, Okay, so here, I have some questions for you, okay? I have some discussion questions for you, okay? Here we go, number one. Number one. Has technology, has technology changed your life? Has technology changed your life? I'd like to know in the comments. Please tell me. N novel means, okay, Tomas, novel is like a gimmick. Just something now, something new. Not, not practical. Just something new. Oh, it's novel. It, it's popular now and soon people will forget about it. So novel is... Something new, but not important. 
Okay, so Lolly says yes for sure. So has technology changed your life? And I can say it's changed my life because YouTube, this is, this is ingenious technology, yeah? I think YouTube is ingenious where um, all over the world we can connect up and I could broadcast me, just little Mark here in my, in my office. I could set up a camera. I could set up a computer. I can set up lights. I have a whiteboard. I have a pen. And we can have a lesson worldwide. Everyone, I, whoever, there's people all over the world watching right now. So I think this is ingenious. This is unbelievable. So yes, technology has changed my life because this is becoming more and more my job. I still have other work, but now YouTube, I spend more time on YouTube making videos and doing these lessons than I do with my other work. So this is ingenious. <laughs> yeah, so Rita says, yes. Um, so technology has made Rita's life easier. So that's fantastic. So Sleepwalker, yes. So Sleepwalker says, yes, she uses YouTube to learn English, like which all of you are doing right now. So ingenious. Yes, it's ingenious. So Lolly says, uh, technology will change our life completely in the future, especially artificial intelligence. Now, that's going to be scary, right? But, um, but if we go slowly, I think it'll be okay. Um, HB says, yes, I can find English teachers. Yes. So technology has changed our life. I think all of us. So that's, that's positive, right? So this is a good thing, right? So I think most people, most people say yes, it's a plus. Okay, number two. Number two. Okay, question two. What new gadgets, what new gadgets do you really want? Okay, what new gadgets do you really want? So if you could tell me in the comments, what new gadgets do you really want? So like, do you want a iPhone? Do you want a laptop computer? Do you want um, a camera to make YouTube videos? What, what gadgets do you want? What gadgets, what new gadgets do you really want? You want like a new PlayStation <laughs> or a, a tablet, Google Smart TV tablet. Yeah, or some, or maybe even like um, the, was it Alexis or something? The, the Google, you could talk in it. Turn on the TV and it turns on the TV. Oh, turn on the light and it turns on the light. That, that's a gadget, right? I want a smart TV and tablet. Okay, new computer. Yeah, okay, great. Okay, and let's see. Let's go ahead and go number three. You can um, be putting your, your um, answers down. I'll just continue. Oh, Lolly really wants a drone. Whoa. Because maybe you can take pictures, right? So sometimes like a drone's cool is where you see um, people who've taken video with a drone and it's you could from from the sky looking down. That's pretty cool, right? That looks nice. Um, okay, question three. What is your favorite gadget that you own? What is your favorite gadget that you own? What's your favorite gadget that you own? What is your favorite 
gadget that you own? What is your favorite gadget that you own? So I think my favorite gadget is this, my MacBook. This is super important. <laughs> I love my MacBook. Yes. So this is number one for me. I, this is the most important thing. I like this. This is my favorite gadget. My, my MacBook Pro computer. Laptop, yeah. Because this goes wherever I go. It travels wherever I go. My computer travels everywhere I go. My wonderful modern laptop. Yes, Lolly. So it's my modern laptop. I really like my modern laptop. <laughs> okay, good, good, good. All right. Yeah, I think most people, computer, because we could do, we can, with our, with our computers, we can watch YouTube videos. We can um, organize our work, our life, make things with our computer. We could read things with our computer. We can um, communicate with people with our computer. Okay, smartphone. Now, see, the smartphone is like close, right? Because this is like a computer, right? So this is, this is a computer, but small, right? So this is connected with my laptop and so I could get my email from both places um, I could take pictures I could take video I can call people I could email people I can check the weather report I can make an appointment I can <laughs> I can do everything right okay yes it, all because the internet right so all this is possible because of the internet Oh, camera, yep, cameras are nice. Okay, great, and one more, number four. Let's do one more question. Question number four, what new gadget are you looking forward to, like in the future? What new gadgets are you looking forward to, so in the future, right? What new gadgets... are you looking forward to? So you don't have it yet. Like maybe in the future, what would be a cool gadget? What would be something um, really cool, something wonderful, something ingenious, right? What new gadgets are you looking forward to? So maybe, um, how about driverless cars, right? So you don't have to drive. It just drives for you. So in your car, you can just be checking your email, and your car drives you to work. Um, or like a robot. What, what, what new gadgets are you looking forward to? What would you like in the future what gadget would you like in the future can you do you have idea or no idea new car magic carpet rita i want a magic carpet <laughs> actually i was reading the newspaper i was reading i was reading the newspaper and they already have like a hover car, like a flying car. So, and then they're gonna have a, a flying scooter too. And this guy, this Frenchman, he he had a, a hoverboard. He flew he flew over the English Channel on a hoverboard. So we are, I think, flying cars are the future, right? So, or flying scooters. We're gonna be like, we don't have to be. Um, bound to the road anymore. We can just be in space. We can be in the air, traveling in the air, like a flying carpet. Yes, Tomas. That's cool. 
Okay, marginal voice, long time no see, yeah. Okay, let's, okay, great. I want to do more. Let's talk more about this, but I need to erase the board, okay, for our next, we're going to do some vocabulary with technology and gadgets. So before I erase this, I'm going to take a picture with my gadget, okay? Here's my gadget, and I'm going to, there's a, a code here. I have to input the code to open it. And here's my gadget, and then I just press the screen. Oh, and there's a camera. What a gadget, okay? So I'm going to use my gadget to take a picture of the whiteboard, okay? So I'm going to step around the camera. You can't see me, but you can hear me because I'm going to take a picture of the whiteboard and I'm going to post it, post it on my Facebook group page. Mark Kulik English Speaking Practice. So I took the picture, and later tonight, I will upload it to my Facebook group page, okay? So I want to erase the board. Okay, so we can do some more discussion about technology and gadgets. Woohoo! Technology and gadgets. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, great. Okay. Let's talk about some vocabulary, all right? Vocabulary. Here we go. So there's, there, of course, like in English, we have um, w words that mean the same thing, but there's like, when we're talking about a, s uh, when we're talking about a topic, we could have... Um, we could use words that have positive meaning, or we can use words that have a negative meaning, okay? So here are like negative, and maybe we could, gadget can be, that could be kind of negative, right? And then um, a positive, we could be maybe like technology, let's say that. Okay, so we might consider gadget as a negative or um, and technology as a positive. And for example, maybe like, um, let, let's do this because these are kind of the topic words here. Um, thing, right? So, oh, it's a thing. Uh, oh, what's that? Oh, it's a thing that takes pictures, right? So it's a thing that takes pictures. Um, or here, it's convenient. Oh, my phone is very convenient. I can take pictures and I can um, send email. Okay, so that's a positive. Um, widget. Widget. So a widget is like a gadget that's just mass produced. A widget is mass produced. So maybe the quality isn't very good. So a widget is, is mass produced in a factory and maybe the, the quality is low. Invention, right? So, oh, this new iPhone, what an invention, right? Oh, it's a great invention. You can take pictures and, and call and do everything on it. What a, it's a great invention. Gimmick. We talked about that in, in Joe and Sue's conversation, right? So a gimmick. It's something new. It, it's not going to last. Like I say here, ingenious. Ingenious, very clever. Um, like someone, a genius made it. <laughs> a genius, someone very, very, very smart invented it. Um, a thingamajig, thingamajig, 
thing I'm a thing I'm a jig. So you don't know the name. It's a thing I'm a jig. So I don't know the name of it, but hmm, it's a thing I'm a jig that takes pictures, or it's a thing I'm a jig that um turns on the TV. It's a thingamajig that drives our car. You know, so how how does how does the driverless car work? Oh, I don't know. It's like a, a thingamajig inside the car. <laughs> so I don't know. It's a thingamajig. I don't know. Um, device. Right? So oh it's a it's a ingenious device to talk to people. It's an ingenious device to uh, communicate. Doohickey. 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 So it's kind of like a, it's a thingamajig. It's a doohickey. Like, how does it work? I don't know. It's not, do, this doohickey makes it go. It's a doohickey, <laughs> the doohickey. I don't know. Um, tool. So my phone is a tool to communicate. It's a tool to, it's a tool to organize my life. It's a tool to um, talk to people all over the world. Doohickey. Ah, uh, some. This doohickey thing, I don't know what it is, a doohickey. I don't know. What is it? I don't know. It's some doohickey. I don't know. <laughs> and then, oh, it's a tool. Okay. And then, um, obsolete. So, obsolete, meaning... It's, it, it won't be useful, obsolete. We, we will not need it. So maybe um, in the future, this will be obsolete. We'll just have, we'll just ha have a watch, right? So everything, so our, our iPhone becomes obsolete because new technology will, will pass the iPhone, right? So the old flip phones, right? So we had the flip phone, and now that's obsolete, right? So the iPhone um, made the flip phone obsolete. And so maybe the next, the next technology will make the iPhone obsolete, for sure, right? Of course. And then... Um, Machine, machine, right? And um, so these are some vocabulary words, important vocabulary words, and they could have like negative and positive connotations, right? So gadgets and technology, so um, maybe like a, a negative with thing. It's a thing to call people it's a it's a widget what is i it's just a widget meaning it's just mass produced low quality gimmick uh it's just a it's just a fad right it's a fad it's it's new but people will soon forget it thingamajig thingamajig ah i don't know the name of it it's a thingamajig uh doohickey same i don't know the name but it's some doohickey and so it's not important. It's a doohickey. Um, obsolete. So this, this gadget will be obsolete in no time. This, this gadget will be obsolete next year. So meaning um, something else will pass it and it's not useful. Or it, it's the new, new technology will make the old technology obsolete. Okay, um, Positive words like, oh, it's convenient. So this, my iPhone is very convenient. Um, this is a great invention. This is ingenious. This, this device, device is ingenious. 
this tool, this tool is ingenious. This tool I use to connect with people all over the world, and it's a machine. <laughs> so it's not a widget. No, it's a machine. It's not a widget. It's a machine. Okay, <laughs> okay. Obsolete goes to the museum. Yes, Tomas. Yes, it does. Okay, now we will take a picture. But first, I want to do a dictation. Are you ready for gadget technology dictation? Woo! So remember we did with the cards. We did dictation cards. Now we're going to do dictation gadgets and technology are you ready if you have a pencil if you have paper this is low tech <laughs> so if you have low tech so sometimes low tech is is the best <laughs> i believe like learning here here we're using youtube and we're using the world internet that's high tech but some of your best learning will be low tech yeah so Let's go low tech here. If you have a pencil, if you have paper, do that, all right? And also, we could go high tech, put it in your computer, all right? So we're going to do, so if you have both, low tech, high tech, that's best, okay? So let's do both, low tech and high tech. <laughs> okay, I will go slowly. Yes, Lolly, slowly. Okay, let's do dictation. Technology and gadgets dictation. All right, here, let's go. Let's do countdown. Here we go. Okay, good, ready, good. Like, okay, here we go. Tomas, yeah. Low tech is always works. That's right. When I do presentations, I like to go low tech because I'm not going to have um, fails, right? The computer is not going to have a problem, right? Sometimes the the projector has problems sometimes the computer has problems but when i do presentations in front of people i always go low tech right okay here we go countdown to dictation time five four three two one number one this banana holder is completely useless number one this Banana holder is completely useless. Number one, this banana holder is completely useless. This banana holder is completely useless. Number one, this banana holder is completely useless useless this banana holder is completely useless this banana holder is completely useless okay lolly this banana banana holder is completely useless this banana holder is completely useless good this banana holder is completely useless. This use this banana holder is completely useless. Holder, hold, holder. It it holds a banana. It's a case, banana case. <laughs> this banana holder is completely useless. Good, good. This banana holder is completely useless. This banana holder is completely useless. Everyone, nice. This banana holder is completely useless. Good, GG. This banana holder, holder, hold, holder, case. It's like a case. This banana holder is completely useless. Yes, HB. Very good. Rita, this banana holder is completely useless completely completely useless completely useless okay good let's go to number two all right count down five 
four, three, two, one. Okay, number two. Okay, let's see real quick. Okay, Lolly, this banana holder is completely useless. Yeah, that's right. Good, good, Lolly. Okay, marginal voice. Yes. This banana holder is completely useless. That's right. And Leza, this banana holder is completely useless. Good, good. Okay, number two. Here we go. I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. <laughs> I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. Number two. I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. Officer Jake. I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. Nope. No way. I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. Hoverboard. I'm not going to buy you a 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 hoverboard. That's one word, hoverboard. H-O-V-E-R-B-O-A-R-D. H-O-V-E-R-B-O-A-R-D. Hoverboard. Okay, that's right. Max, but it's one word, hoverboard. I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. H O V E R B O A R D hoverboard. I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. Okay, Mia, very good. I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. That's right. Yes, Max. Good, good. I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. I'm hoverboard is one word H O V E R B O A R D hoverboard. I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. 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 I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. Thank you, Mia. Okay, number three. Number three. Oh, Lolly, I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. That's it. Perfect, perfect. Okay, great job. Okay, number three. Count down. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Number three. No way. There can't be vacuum cleaner shoes. <laughs> no way. There can't be vacuum cleaner shoes. Rita, I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. Very good. Paulina, I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. Marginal voice. What is a hoverboard? So it's like a skate, it's a board like a skateboard or a surfboard, and it, it goes over the ground on the air. It hovers. Like a hovercraft is like a boat, and it goes over the ocean. And it travels over. So if this, let's say my paper is the ground, and it's a board, and it goes up. So they had those. So if you saw Back to the Future, um, Michael J. Fox, he's on a hoverboard. And they have those now. That's new. They do that now. Okay, let's see. Rita. Okay, okay, Lolly. No way. They, 
no way, there can't be vacuum shoes. No way, there can't be vacuum cleaner shoes. No way, there can't be vacuum cleaner shoes. Vacuum cleaner shoes. No way, there can't be vacuum cleaner shoes. Yeah, no way, there can't be vacuum cleaner shoes. No way, there, there, there can't be vacuum cleaner shoes. No way, there can't be vacuum cleaner shoes. No way, there, there, there are, there, there are, there can't, there can't be vacuum cleaner shoes. There can't be vacuum cleaner shoes. Marginal voice, no way, there can't be vacuum cleaner shoes. Yes, vacuum cleaner. So like, tr like a normal vacuum cleaner, you're, you're holding it and it goes over the ground. Shoes that you walk and they, they uh, and they clean up when you're walking. <laughs> No way, there can't be vacuum cleaner shoes. Very good. No way, there can't be vacuum cleaner shoes. No way, there can't be vacuum cleaner shoes. Okay, I'm going to write these down. These three, I'm going to write them down so we could, you could have a look. And I'll take a picture too. Okay, number one, this banana holder is completely useless. Whoops. Completely useless. Number two. I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. No way. I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. No. No way. You'll die. And they're too expensive. No way. There can't be vacuum cleaner shoes. There are. I saw them. There are vacuum cleaner shoes. No way. There can't be vacuum cleaner shoes. I can't believe it. No way. What kind of gimmick is that? It's a gimmick, right? Vacuum cleaner shoes. It's got to be a gimmick, right? No way. It's got to be a gimmick. No way. Okay, number one, more time. This banana holder is completely useless. I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. I'm not going to buy you a hoverboard. Vacuum is clean up, pick up. So these shoes, on the bottom of the shoes, there's like a little vacuum and and so you're walking in the house and you're vacuuming at the same time so usually we have you know a vacuum cleaner we hold it and it's big makes a lot of noise but um these are shoes the banana holder is completely obsolete obsolete uh i am not going to buy a hoverboard no way there can't be a vacuum cleaner shoes that's right uh, no way, there can't be vacuum cleaner shoes. No, there can't be. No way. Okay, well, let's do this one. Okay, let's go over this, and then we're going to go, okay? So let's just, one more time, let's go over this vocabulary. Gadget, it's a thing. Widget is something mass-produced. Um, it's it's um, kind of load it's 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 uh it, it uh, 
low quality, right? A widget, low quality. Gimmick, something that's kind of useless. Just It's just um, something new. Thingamajig, something you don't know the name of it. Like you don't know you don't know the name of the gadget, but you just call oh it's a thingamajig. Doohickey, same thing. You don't know the name of the gadget. You just say oh it's a doohickey. Um, obsolete, obsolete, obsolete. Where it's it, it won't there'll be new technology will take over. And then technology, convenient invention. Ingenious device, tool, machine. Okay, yay! <laughs> what I, I'm after two hours, I start crashing. So I start saying things. I start mispronouncing things. <laughs> I am crushing. Okay, I need to take a picture of the whiteboard, and I will. Post it on my Facebook group page, Mark Kulik English Speaking Practice, all right? So let me open my gadget, walk around and take a picture. You can't see me, but you can hear me, okay? Here we go. Countdown. Four, three, two, one. Okay, I got the picture. I will upload all these pictures to my Facebook group page, Mark Kulik English Speaking Practice. Okay, everyone, thanks so much. We didn't, get, uh, we didn't get everything done, of course, and we never do. We will do this, continue this on Friday. Friday, 10 a.m. Japan time, okay? So please come back Friday and we'll, we'll continue talking about gadgets and technology. And of course, we will do other things as usual, right? We will do um, Lolly's Revenge, Joe and Sue. We will do picture speculation. We will do um, um, picture guessing game and more dictation cards and vocabulary index cards, everything else. And green girls were in the house. That's right, Lolly. Lolly is a green person because she's a member of the channel. So Lolly likes what I'm doing, so she's helping me, and I'm helping her. So by helping me, I can help you. So if you enjoy my videos, if you enjoy my live stream lessons, please consider being a member. So hit this, and you could read about it and see what, um, what you get for joining the channel. And of course, for flashcards and worksheets, please check out my website, markcoolit.com. And of course, there are people who don't subscribe, so please subscribe, like, and share with all your friends. Please help me grow my channel. I really appreciate it. Um, competition. Where is my comp? I don't know. Jake, where is your competition? <laughs> okay, so everyone, Thanks so much. I really appreciate you being here because without you, there's no reason for me to be here, right? You're here, so I'm here. If you're not here, then why am I here, right? Ah, no reason. So everyone, thanks so much. Um, oh, you can't see them? Sorry. That, it's hard because I have to write a lot. So what I do, um, I take pictures of the whiteboard and I put it on my Facebook group page. Mark Kulik English Speaking Practice. So then you can, you can check out the whiteboards anytime, and then on your computer, it'll be big, right? So um, it's hard for me. If I wrote the letters really big, I wouldn't get much on the whiteboard. So I try to make them big, right? But sometimes it gets hard because I start filling up the whiteboard, and sometimes I kind of forget to write them big. So sorry about that. Anyways, okay. I'll see everyone Friday, 10 a.m., okay? So um, thank you. Love you guys. You are the best. You are the World English Army. I love the World English Army. You are fantastic. You are the best. Um, okay, so I have to go now. <laughs> I'm going to count down to stopping the stream. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Thanks, everyone. And I'll see you next time, Friday. 
um, August 9th at 10 a.m. Japan time. Okay, bye-bye. Take it easy. Have a great week and be careful and um, don't let the gadgets take over your life. Get out, go for a walk, read a book. Low-tech is good. Some t we want both, high-tech and low-tech. Okay, don't forget the low-tech. <laughs> don't forget the low-tech. <laughs> okay, bye-bye. See you.